Comets are one of the most popular things to go out to see and image in amateur astronomy. They're also very unpredictable. I'm Michael Martin and welcome to Late Night Astronomy, your guide to the best objects, events, and equipment to help you go out to explore the night sky. In what may be one of the best comets of 2023, Comet C 2022 E3 ZTF makes its close approach to Earth throughout the month of January and early February. ZTF begins January in the Northern Hemisphere by rising in the Northeast around 2.30 a.m. in the morning. As the month goes on, it'll move higher in the sky each night, making for better views at more reasonable times each evening. While it begins January in the early morning sky, it moves quickly each night and will be near the constellation Comma Partalis for its close approach to Earth around February 2nd, giving us some nice views of it all night about an hour after sunset. If all goes well, Comet ZTF should just be visible to the naked eye under dark skies at this point, but the best views will still come from binoculars and a telescope. Throughout February, both northern and southern hemispheres can track it traveling through the constellation Auriga and Taurus, with it even coming close to Mars on February 11th. So what can you expect to see of this comet realistically? Well, going out with the naked eye, if it meets or exceeds our expectations, you're probably going to see a dim pinpoint of light. If you've got a pair of binoculars, you're going to see a small blurry snowball of an object. And if you've got a telescope, you might see a tail coming out of that small, blurry snowball of an object. It all depends on if Comet ZTF exceeds what we're hoping it does, or if it completely underperforms or falls apart before it passes Earth for its close approach. It's a comet, so it's really hard to tell. If you've enjoyed this video, please like it and consider subscribing to this channel to join our growing community. And please let me know of any experiences or questions that you have out viewing or imaging Comet ZTF in the comment section below. Thank you all so much for your continued support and clear skies from late night astronomy.